Hello? 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 Anything? Uh, Brother Burger. Drunk Brother Burger. What does Drunk Brother Burger taste like? Sloppy. A mess. You made a thumbnail? I did. Uh, I learned how to build my own AI models and with all the HAL images I've rendered, I compiled that into a uh, AI model. So the art is sourced from me. 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 Me art. Me. What? Like this game? Yes, I do. What? Yes. It's a bloodstain. Hmm. If it was caused by physical trauma, then there's something unusual about it. That would be that there's no cloth damage. Hmm. Will we leave off? Demons and death? Yes. There's no damage to the clothing. Either there's a reason why, or this blood didn't come from this person. Yeah, I stopped because I was 11 hours into a stream when I said, ouch, so then I went to bed. I don't see anything else about this body. Yeah, there's nothing else about this I can spot. Eyeball. Dirt? I don't know if that'll count. The missing area of skull is this Chloe had swallowed pieces of Whoa. So it was like I thought after Chloe swallowed the bone fragments the mysterious foci appeared in her body There's something in this bone some kind of pathogen Hmm. Oh, Dr. Kimishima, that man came by a moment ago. That man? Who are you talking about? The, uh, friendly guy. He said something about having finished reconstructing the body. Ah, you mean Gabe. All right, now we can observe the corpse as a whole. I've gone ahead and put the skull with the rest of the skeleton. You can look at them whenever you like. Good, you're on top of things. Can you tell me what you've observed from it? Why is Doctor being a detective? This is a, a coroner, investigator, woman, lady person who does, like, bone searching stuff. There's a bioterror outbreak and we're trying to solve why the fuck it's happening and how to stop it. Good. I'll look into it. It's possible to examine the body now, too. Bone. Bone. Why is she so pale? Anime. Hmm. What is this damage to the joint? Hard to think that an external force could cause this kind bone of bone tumor. Hmm. 
case, the femur is completely broken, but why? In the human skeleton, the femur is the tastiest bone. Yes, it was the same in the case when that girl Veronica was thrown off the bridge. But the femur is the strongest among all the bones in the human body. What could have broken this so easily? What's this? These scratches on the bone look like an area that's been shaved off. Oh. Looks like I need to look into what caused this damage. Oh. It's hard to think that an extra... I don't know what else I could look at. Time to put together some clues. Whoa, well, thumbnail. Yeah. Yeah. But they're both the same purple. Little guy, can I bother you for a moment? Yes, of course. How may I help you? Well, Neo, the Grim's Shake trend. I can't order the Grim's Shake anymore. Like, I actually can't. It's it's not available in my area. I want your opinion on this fractured femur. Oh, okay. Just a second. Well, anything? Well, huh. What's this? This bone is hollow on the inside. I'm not surprised it broke if it was like this. Hmm. Did this fracture occur while the person was still alive? I can't say about the fracture, but the loss in bone density must have occurred while the person lived. It seems safe to assume that the fracture was caused by the decrease in bone density then. Yeah, I mean, that wiki is completely out of date. Someone needs to update that that fix they have there should not be enabled. It breaks your shit. Yeah, I, I can't do the Grimace Shake. Like, I, I, it's not available. Also, I don't care about the Grimace Shake. I like I like the the M and M one because I go I eat it. Yeah. Little guy, I need this damage analyzed. Right away. What's the matter? Uh, nothing. A bone abrasion caused this damage. Do the barber shake and reach full gay? Hmm. Bone abrasion? What do you mean? Okay, meat, a layer of fibrocartilage. In this case, the knee, that pad is known as the meniscus. That prevents damage like this from occurring in most people's bodies. The signs of wear I see here are consistent with the bones grinding together. Hmm. So these Trauma are going to get a video? Not for me, no. By... I got a Mario Party video and an RE Scraps video to work on. I'm not going to cut this together. That being said, I know there's people out there that make fan edits. I should make a playlist of all like fan edits that I approve. Like Neo approved fan edits. I should make a playlist and put it on my channel. Fuck. Fuck. That was careless. Indeed. This would mean that the meniscus was lost while the person was still alive and moving. But what would cause this to happen? Okay. I need this bone analyzed, little guy. Be point click game. With it. There's well, the danger of detective infection. stuff, yeah. Oh, can you warn me a little sooner next time? Give me a moment, please. Let's see here. Well, did you find anything? Hmm. No, I've checked it out, but there's nothing especially unusual about it. Hmm, is that so? That's odd. What's so odd about that? Of the content you accumulate, how much do you throw away percentage-wise? 98%. This is the bone that Chloe swallowed. 
When she did, the same black focus that the patients in the quarantine zone had showed up inside her body. According to what Gabe said, the serviceman who had been investigating this bone Firm. Firm. Oh. So, in other words, the pathogen lurking in this bone is pure evil. Right. This bone carries a virus that triggers the hemorrhagic fever. Virus? But this is just a skeleton. A virus requires living cells from its host in order to multiply. So, this virus not only survives the host's death, but can continue within a skeletonized corpse. Can you really say that such a thing is impossible? Uh, but... That's not like you. Calm down, little guy. <sighs> Everything we've seen up until now has taught us something. That there are diseases out there in the world that defy all our understanding and what we think of as common sense. <sighs> all right. Let's assume that it is a virus. That doesn't mean that all the mysteries have been solved. How does this virus live inside this skeleton? And why aren't we infected with the hemorrhagic fever after we've handled the bones? I really can't say at this point. It's possible this person was infected with the virus, or perhaps the skeleton had been contaminated after death. In any case, we'll need to continue investigating this in more detail. Right. However, I can explain why you and I haven't contracted the hemorrhagic fever. What? How? Well, according to what Gabe was told by the assistant secretary... <laughs> That's right. They concluded that an airborne infection was impossible. This was because the infection wasn't spreading within New Samarid. If that's the case, it's unlikely that the virus is dispersed through a respiratory vector. Then how does it spread? Well, in Chloe's case, the foci were located in areas where... Fuck. How could I do that? Uh, 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 fucking, um, uh. Indeed, the black foci only existed in areas that the bone fragments were in contact with. Taking that into consideration, this virus's root of infection is eating bones. Eating, eating bones. Need to eat the bones. Fuck. Ugh. I don't know what words are. Yes. In other words, the virus only has a limited means of transmission. I see. That explains the cat's case, at least. But what about the Usamrid researcher? I highly doubt that he'd be chewing on bones. Hmm. Good point. There must be an explanation for how that other serviceman was infected as well. Yeah. normal decrease in bone density with a lack of cartilage. What we can deduce from these two events is... Whoa. Yes. Both these conditions indicate a weakening of the skeletal system. Furthermore, I believe that both these processes happened while the person was still alive. It's not my alive. me, loud stomper, but thanks. If these conditions allow us to infer anything, it would be that this person was severely debilitated by the time of death. I knew. Hi! Little guy, I need you to analyze something. Of course. Is this a blood stain? Right. I need you to check the skeleton's d yep. uh, no. Do you have the results yet? Hey, don't rush me. It seems that the DNA matches 
Huh, I see. If that's the case, if this hemorrhaging wasn't caused... Why does she call him a little guy? Mm. Lore. He exploded. Hey, little guy? Yes, of course. Hmm, how does it look? Uh, there's no discoloration on the... Hmm, I see. Th That's right. I don't, from looking at the damaged area, it seemed... A router? The only reason I would expect that... That's right. The staff at USAMARIT was using this bone for research. There's a good chance they shaved a sample from the bone in order to study it. Yes, you need small fragments for the high de- Hmm. What's wrong? The researcher at USAMARIT was in- Using a router on the bone would cause part of- If the researcher came down with the disease- He ate it. He ate. That's right. Now we're starting to see the virus rests with the root of infect. Psychic power. That's an interesting thumbnail. Thanks. Thank you. Yes. It's when it comes in contact with a mucous membrane. Reaching a mucous membrane within the mouth or body causes the virus to infect that person. But there's no way that a researcher would lick or swallow a bone. However, the USAMARID staff did collect a bone sample for their research. In order to obtain that sample, the researcher... Is it recent? I just made it like half an hour ago. Right. He used a router to shave away a portion of the bone. This is likely what caused the researcher to be infected. The reason for this is... bone with a router causes particles of bone dust to fly out into the air. It's likely that the researcher inhaled some of that powder while he was working. The powder then carried the infection and made contact with the mucous membranes. That is my hypothesis to explain the infection of the Usamarid researcher. How do you get the Hellhead to look so Hell with AI? I learned how to build my own image models. I, I made that with my own model from my own images that I rendered from my own computer. Yes. Oh, but it's bone. You, you, Hal Maker. Yeah. How long did it take to get the final image? Two hours. It takes a long time to, like, get uh ai to make an image that doesn't look like complete dog ass That the blood stain, but there was no obvious. Can you investigate in detail into what kind of hem? I see. Of course. Uh, did you nitpick the generation, or did you fix it with in painting? Uh, I did a fuck ton of different iterations. Like, okay, so the way it works, I type in what I want, and then I let it do a hundred different iterations of that prompt. I choose which one's the closest, grab that one, and then I will look at the seed associated with that PNG and make a hundred iterations on that, choose off of that one, and then start in-painting errors. 
Okay. That being said, how would you feel if I started, um, if I started making, uh, HAL thumbnails for streams? How would that make you feel and think and, and like, move? Depends on how hot the thumbnails would be. I don't want to get banned from YouTube. So, you know, check pockets. Is this a key? Okay. Maybe little guy will be able to find out something about it. Maybe you could put the AI model up as a patron word or something. Uh, probably not, because it's got a bunch of Halcock in it. Whoops, hit the wrong thing. Keys. Hey, little guy. A key? This is a very unique key. Magnets? Probably a sick. Hmm. I... What's wrong? We don't have a clue. It'll take a long time. That's fine. It's well, we are a nationwide. I'll let you. Great. Also, profit from AI art is a no no. True. Uh, all the AI art I've done so far has just been for shit posts. That being said, the AI model for HAL was built by me. It's my images, my renders. All that is my work. So, hypothetically. Depending on the uh, checkpoint model that I use upon the lower model that I built, it could be ethical. But still, it's it's only shit post for right now, so it's fine. Where am I? Hello? Does this mean that AI could one day generate Hal Goatsy? Yep. Bone. Wouldn't building a Lacoris model instead of lower model be net better results? I don't know. Listen, I just started getting into this like a week ago. Like just a week ago, I started getting into this whole field. So I don't know. Hmm. I'm just gonna run this man's pocket. See, he apparently this just has a bunch of shit on him. Whoever this, if I ask little guy. Okay. Does it require a good PC? A PC, but as long as you're not trying to make checkpoint models, you'll, you should be fine. There's no reason to make a checkpoint model anyways. It's really costly. It's, it's kind of dumb. Little guy? Yes, of course. I found this in the deceased's personal articles. I see. Here. This is the kind of thing that we... I'll look into what's in these... It's going to take a... Of course. Great. Uh, Dr. Kimishima. The syringe. Oh, yes. Interferon. Slow down. Um, it's the medicines that... All that was in there? Seriously, I don't understand. Every antiviral drug on record is antiviral. There was even an ampule of ash Ashman? It's a medicine that hasn't been fully authorized. It's an excellent antiviral drug. Huh. Okay, it draws on the patient's calcium to suppress. If used in excess, the subject will the body then draws calcium from the bones and it leads to all a drug that robs calcium from the bones. Well, that isn't its purpose, of course. I see. The deceased had a large amount of antibody along with a dangerous, unapproved drug that caused... Hmm. He actually had the bone hurting juice. Yeah, he had that. In theory, it should. Look it up, I might save you a couple dozen hours. The model will be a bit heavier, but it's worth it. Heavier. 
Does that mean it needs a higher quantity? It takes a longer time to build, or is it just a larger file size? What do you mean by heavier? Yes, the large amounts of antiviral drugs found in the corpse's personal effects, and an ampule of ashfins, okay. a dangerous antiviral reagent. The reason that ashfins was never approved was because. Bone. Indeed, a 50 kilogram person's body contains roughly one kilogram of calcium. 99% of that is in the bones and teeth. In other words, the side effect of the Ashfin's drugs is... Bones. Well, bones. Yes. What first comes to mind would be an abnormal decrease in bone density. Considering the information, this person likely admit... An enemy. Yes. The first piece of evidence supporting... Yes. The complete fracture continuing on this. Bone. Yes. The loss of the meniscus in the left knee. Thus, we can deduce that the person's weakened skeletal system was due to the side effects of the Ashvin's drug. Wow. I have a bad feeling about this. Yes, it's these bones passed on the viral hemorrhagic fever via contact with mucous membranes. And whoever this was, they had been taking large doses of antiviral drugs along with a dangerous unapproved one. It's likely that this person was... Yeah. Fuck. Okay. Yes. This individual had been infected with some kind of virus. That virus itself was... If that's the case, then the cause of death was... I should stop making conjectures. I need some hard evidence to back these theories up. Hemorrhagic fever causes hemorrhaging from all over the body. Yep. If we could find tra... Hemorrhaging from all over. Is something wrong? Oh, well, we just received the results from the analysis. It says that the blood stain on the person... Oh, no. If that's the case... Vomited. Vom... Yes, it came through the mouth. That would explain why there were no signs of death. Oh. The, the viral hemorrhagic oh. fever causes bleeding, vomiting blood. Hmm. This person, the evidence that I'm. Fuck. Concentrate. The evidence that this person died of viral hemorrhagic fever is the clothing was unchanged. A wound on the abdomen. None of these sound right. We just talked about it being uh, like blood and saliva. Think clothing. The clothing was unchanged. What the fuck? All this sounds stupid. Every single one of these sounds wrong. None of these sound right. Not a single one sounds like the right answer. The clothing was unchanged. Whatever, dude. That's right. Just say but there was blood on his clothes. What? Had an attack of vomiting stupid. Blood. I highly doubt that they'd go on without doing something about the bloody clothes. Thus, the traces of vomited blood. Dumb. We finally figured out the cause of death. Yes, long before the pandemic that is currently raging broke out. This person caught and who in the world are you? Dr. Kimishima. Go on. I've noticed. I'm Molly. Well, this antivirus, it was rejected by the FD. That along with these things. Are you have a point. Indeed. It would be 
He's someone who has the knowledge of these new drugs and their effects on viruses. It would also be someone who has the authority to obtain such information from the medical community. Okay. That's what I think. Does that help a little? It's fantastic. How can we identify... But all we have... Hmm. That shouldn't be a problem. If this person is in the health profession, by studying the bones, we can... Why'd you ask me if you already knew... We don't have time. Look up details about... Send what you find... Oh. Yikes. Uh, <laughs> there, I found them. You want... Now it's time for the grand <laughs> reveal. Let's compare... Then we can... Con Great. Bell was... Head. Eyeball. Rib. Um. Um. There's no damage to the pelvis. I should look at its shape. We can determine some. And then... But you said to examine... But... Bitch, you... The skull has triangular orbital bones. Is there any information? The cranial sutures have begun to fuse, but they aren't completely fused yet. I thought that shit fused when you were like five. What? This is what's causing the cranial sutures to resemble broken lines instead of solid ones. I thought the skull was done when you were like five. I recall that the cranial sutures can tell something about a body. You can't be a kid. No. Giant baby. Maybe. What the fuck? Bro, I was even looking at it. Why are you being annoying? That's right. A person's age at death. The cranial sutures. I don't fucking know. around anymore it's time to get serious I don't know how the fuck would I know yes in other words dope thanks for that an individual's gender can be determined by the shape of the pelvis. According to the materials at hand, this skeleton's gender is... I can't make any more rash decisions. I need to think cautiously. <laughs> oh my god. I can't mess around anymore. It's time to get serious. Yes, thus. Great. The German physician Blumenbach established a distinction of five major branches of human anatomy. One point mentioned in determining a person's race by skeletal features is the shape of the orbital bones. Comparing this with the materials at hand, this skeleton's race is... I can't make any more rash decisions. I need to think cautiously. How in the fuck? would I know? I can't even look at it right now. Okay. Oh, so if I looked at both of what he just told me. That's on me. Triangular. Caucasian. The Squid game. One can, I can't make any more rash decisions. I need to think cautiously. In <laughs> 
15 types of amino. There was a very high... If I could... I can't make any more rash decisions. I need to think cautiously. That's nice right. Sturgeon. No! Someone had this disease too. This fact alone won't get us a Caucasian male in his... All the info now will be able to... Whoa. Skull. We couldn't identify this body after all. Skull, skull. Stein, I don't care. But there is an important fact. <laughs> this is my least favorite now. missions next to intestine hell. First, let's sort out what we do now. We'll talk later. Did you just say that to the skeleton? <laughs> First <laughs> is the time since death. The card with that is. Yes. The nitrogen and amino acids in the bones prove that. Remember, the body's soft tissue was gone before it was found. This suggests that the body wasn't underwater or buried. Next, mm -hmm. I have the card stating the gender of the body. Correct. The shape of the pelvis, the face, and bones prove that. However, he had a thin build. He could hardly be muscular. Next, okay. the age. This card tells our findings. Yes, the cranial sutures have fused with age. This proves that this person was at least in his 50s. Can you make the I am a sturgeon it's face? To determine his race as well. I don't want to get that emotional for no reason. This card shows my Whoa. conclusion based on the evidence. What are we talking about? Okay. Racial differences Hello, job. are mainly exhibited in skull shape. The eye sockets, cheekbones, nose ridge. It's clear. Yep. Our next clue is his occupation. Now, this is only speculation. I heard you tried burgers but earlier. How are they? This card shows what he did. Fine. Me. Yes. If the items belonged to him, he was in medicine. In addition, it's likely that he worked in pathology. Now then. What was the cause of his untimely demise? That was by identification. This card shows Fine. that reason. Fine. I'm playing to do next after this game. Edit Mario Party, honestly. Whoops. A virus living within a corpse long after the host dies. I don't want to believe it, but bones don't lie. The virus passes into the mucous membranes on contact. He died like the man Gabe diagnosed. Hemorrhagic fever. No, Aria, break. Why the fuck would I play that? He understood what was happening. He knew why he died. He knew, and it shows in the last words he had to say. My son, forgive me. Doctor How? Yeah. I was enticed by the devil. That is the truth illuminated by the light of this life. With this in mind, I can use the data to find an individual. <gasps> He's... A sturgeon. <laughs> hey. hey, you listening? Where are you going? Just be quiet and follow me. We need to talk to the chief. Chief, I'd like to speak with you. Did I finish acknowledge? I got bored, dude. Made me sleepy. Uh, what did you say? It may be hard to believe, but listen to me, please. The bones Gabe came here with contained the infectious virus. But since the infection is not carried by air, the chances of these bones being a source of pandemic is low. However, they may still be a clue to finding a solution. 
I can't believe the two of you could find out so much. No, this is just a coincidence. Still, Dr. Tachibana should be done with a biopsy on the same virus. Hmm. A vector of infections unknown, but we've ID'd it. You think we'll make it in time? It's near hopeless. The disease advances too rapidly. The infected will all die before we finish the DNA analysis. God damn it. Isn't there any other lead we can follow? This isn't a clue, but I have one more thing I must report. You must report? I compared the reconstructed bones to our database. Only one person was a match for the data we had. Who is it? Him? Yes, Albert Sartre, a professor of virology, who vanished after the Cumberland College incident. Whoa. Oh, fuck! Oh, fuck. Please tell me it's an event. Nope. Oh, my God. Okay. God damn it. God fucking damn it. All right. <clears throat> okay. Hey, where are you going? You die. This place. Final Maria mission, you can do it. I grew up here. <laughs> At least until I started that fire. Why did we come here? We're looking for Rosalia Rosalini, right? It's coming back to me. Cry baby Rose. She was so small and was always sad. You know her? What an idiot. I saved her just that one time. But that kid, she remembered me. What do you mean? Uh, nothing. Look, at least we have a lead. Story good. Let's it's go. stupid as shit. But it's fun. Mm. It's dumb fun. Like RE6 fun. Good. Ross, Adele. Damn, where is it? These records Hank or Chris? are over a Hank. decade old. Will they help us? Hank is OP. We're not looking for records. I got news five years ago. The orphanage said that a letter had come for me. The incident at Cumberland College was eight years ago. If the letter is five years old, we could find Professor Sot. Do you resent him? Yeah. No. I... How? I just want to know what happened. I want the truth. Aaron. Of care. Hope Rosalia. you're ready to operate on a ghost. <laughs> Did you, really why it? would you spoil that? Why what? would you spoil no that? Mistake. It's her. Why? Why? Bro, I'm like right about. Did you actually. I'm literally about to play the fucking mission. Are you serious? That idiot. The letter doesn't say anything. No return address. You don't know what happens. Actually. Huh? Look at the picture. Monarch butterflies. But these flowers in the background are cosmos. So? Monarchs only stay in America until the end of the summer. That doesn't match the cosmos blooming season. Then you're saying... Right. This picture wasn't taken anywhere in America. W where was it taken then? At the end of the summer, the monarch butterfly. 
they head south to find Asclepius to feed the larvae. Heading south? Well, then that means... Yes. She's in Mexico. Rose. What the... Who ratted me out? Tons of them. Oh, that was the police. Damn it, there must be something going on. We have to go. By the way, that speaks volumes for the game and the fact that I did ask that we're going to operate on a ghost. Like, it would not surprise me. It would not be like, there's no way. What's going on? I don't have time to explain. Just get back here. All right, let's go. in tons of patients. Listen carefully to me, Maria. Effective treatment varies depending on how far along it is. I'll tell you which medicines to use for each patient. You, why are you here? Save the talking for later. Let's begin the treatment. Jesus Christ. Okay, hope you're ready for stress. I hope you're ready for stress. Uh, I don't have time to explain an, an entire silent drive later. Well, she's busy, you know, she is helping people. <clears throat> All right, here we go. How can there be so many patients? It's not just the infected. I'm watching. The people who are fainting and convulsing are causing secondary injuries. We just have to do this. I'm going to tell you about the medication, so listen carefully. Now, as I mentioned earlier, there is no cure for the virus. However, its activities can be controlled using existing antiviral drugs. We'll be using an immunoglobulin reagent to specify the onset type. First, select the drug. The reagent is in the white vial. Use the syringe to inject it into the affected area. Hey, nothing happened. What am I supposed to do now? Calm down. The drug is also a color reagent. Watch the area until the secondary body's HRP enzyme activity changes color. What the fuck? Are you kidding me? This is so inefficient. Should I check on the other patient until this reaction kicks in? I'll leave that decision to you. However, the reaction only lasts for a short period of time. You should focus on this patient for now. Okay. All right. The reaction to the reagent has colored the area. Now inject the antiviral drug of the same color as the affected area. That's convenient. Good. The drug is having an effect. That will suppress the virus's activities for a while. Damn. Only for a while? It can't cure it completely? Impossible. The conditions will worsen again over time. We have no choice but to re-inject the drug before that happens. So, we have to memorize which drug works on which patient and keep sticking away. Goddamn pain in the ass. There's no other way. We have to do this. What the fuck? Don't forget to treat the patient's wounds while injecting the drugs. Oh my god! <laughs> I got it. Damn it. Let's begin. Get ready for it. She's hemorrhaging a lot. It's from the abdomen. Beginning hemostasis. Get ready for it. Give me over the five dollars. It's fine. I just firmly believe that that could have been a spoiler. Bitch! So sorry, Come I on! Think that for a game like this, it might have happened. We have a pulse securing an airway. Not yet. Not yet. Not yet. Not yet. Bro, fuck you for making me do this right now. Oh. Reagent has been injected. Now wait for a reaction to appear. 
there's just no end to this. No, wait. Oh. We did it. Damn it. Why don't we don't look here, too? Shut they the fuck up! Patients. Shut up, dude! Damn, there's more? I'll be right there. Treat the hemorrhaging and the infection together. Great, it's working. Just stay put now. Directly on them. Okay. Some damn color. I know they're infected. How many people have this damn disease? Usually you can just inject anywhere with the green, so I was just on that line set. one did I did I use the wrong one what happened Make sure you're saved. 
energy stabilized. Now is our chance to transport. Hey, are you all right? This, this one's got lacerations. No problem. We can treat these easily. Thank <laughs> you. 
more. We're going to save you no matter what. Intubation successful. Take her in. Treatment complete. I'm going in to help the other doctors. You can count on me. Damn it, how many... Jesus. <sighs> Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. Maria, are you alright? Damn it, I'm at my limit. This stupid fucking game. I'm it done. always Is gives me a C on Maria. Yet? Stupid shit, man. Silly shit. Hell. Is it true you brought him here? Huh? What's that got to do with... No, no, you, you did a good thing. Get everyone, right now. What? Be serious, can't you see what's going on here? I see it just fine. This avalanche is picking up speed. Every second costs lives. I'll be in the conference room. Damn it, what am I supposed to do? Chief! What are you doing? Hurry up and go! I'll take over here. What are you saying? I'm the paramedic. You should be... Can you carry all these lives? Don't be so cocky. <laughs> go, Maria. Wow. Don't run away from your responsibilities. Wow. Damn it. Tomoe, everyone, get to the conference room. Great. Cool. Fuck you. Let's go. Yep, intentional monk. Yep, intentional. Did it. It was funny. I laughed. In their faces, they died. It was funny. I'm sure that you resent me. Thanks for the five dollars. It's only natural. I robbed you of your past and future. I... I don't resent you. You gave me the life I had to begin with. Good job, Neo. A shame you've strangled that last patient to death with a bandage. Yep. Bones. Bones. Professor Sartre. Brains. Are you done? Yes. All right. Everybody here? Roni, take it away. Yes, doctor. Let us begin. The outbreak began in Portland and has quickly spread. I have collated and analyzed all the information at hand. What? Then... So, do we know what it is? A picture says a thousand words. Our guest of honor. Is that it? A group 5 RNA virus of the Phyloviridae family. Yet its nucleic acid does not match any existing data. So is this a new type of virus? That's right. We've named it the Rosalia virus. Rosalia. Rose. A medical professor at Cumberland College, Albert Sartre, found it in the blood of a girl he had adopted. 
Ironically enough, he was infected by it and died. <sighs> now listen up. This thing's life cycle has two stages. First, a dark stage, where it replicates itself undetected. Let me provide some additional information. In this stage, it fragments itself and infects cells. And there's no way for us to confirm the virus's presence. That means that only a process of elimination works. Correct. The only sign is unexplained tumor formation. The Rosalia virus inhibits the tumor suppression gene. The infected cell then replicates, forming a tumor. So, we can't see the virus, but it'll make tumors. Great. No kidding. But, we're just getting to the best part. Once the latent virus replicates enough, the next step begins. The virus fragments merge into their full form, and then attach to organs and veins, forming colonies. A couple hundred million of them start eating nearby cells. Is that what those bruises are? That's right. Those black bruises are the dying cells' voiceless screams. <laughs> wow. It doesn't end there. The colony continues to grow. Once the colony reaches a certain size, it bursts. There's no way to stop the viruses that break free. Veins, organs, bones, they devour anything they find. Did you go through this? A poll about five days ago. How can we save the infected? Is there any way to stop? No such method exists. That's right. The patient has three days after the explosion. Excision of tumors and colonies won't eradicate the virus. And as there's no vaccine, all America will die in a week. Seven days? Th that can't be. So we just give up? Screw that! There is no way in hell I'll... No. We find the only possible option we have. Only option? What possibility? An anti-serum. An anti-serum? I was considering that. If the virus came from Rosalia, then she must have been infected with it at that point. But she sent a letter to Maria three years later. Doesn't that sound odd to you? What's so odd about that? There's no cure, yet she was infected without falling ill. She's a natural host. Natural host? An organism that coexists with an infectious virus. We need to get a sample of her blood for an antiserum. There's no other way. Yeah, one majority vote. Now, this one majority vote. Democratic game. Wait a sec. This place is under quarantine. Flights are grounded. How the hell are we going to get to Mexico? What else can we do? Sit here, do nothing, and wait to die? Impossible or not, we've got to do it. My helicopter is on the roof. <laughs> we yeah. need to get past the quarantine perimeter. Woo! You? Yeah. Why are you here? Once this is over, I'll have to arrest you. Got it? We all owe you one. Thanks. Great. Let's go. Yeah. All right, then. Shall we get back to business? Indeed. This is our fight now. 
We'll keep this place safe. Let's go. Sick. So cool. We don't have enough transfusion packs. Hurry, get more. You! Don't glare at me like that. We've got the transfusions. Rosalia bruises on the back. Might be spinal infection. All right, let's start. If you're in the way, move it. What? Hey, guys! Whew. Can't put up with all that noise. <laughs> What's so funny? I'm glad you're back. I'm going to rely on you. <laughs> you're always making a big deal out of everything. Come on. Let's hurry and get this over with, partner. Right. Okay. Yo, do you remember that odd patient we had to get charts for? Odd patient? Oh, the one with the spinal tumor. Right. This one's condition is very similar to that patient from before. I'm afraid it's the same focus. I see. So this patient also suffers from ependymoma. Yeah, there's no doubt about it. You got Great. it. Let's do this. All right, we'll need to excise the vertebral arches first. Let's be very sure of what we're doing. Let's keep going and excise the other side. Exterior median sulcus. Careful now. Good. I'm going to continue <clears> the excision. <throat> We're dealing with a vital piece of human anatomy. Don't mess up, okay? <clears throat> it's gonna move the camera, which is gonna fuck me up, so I gotta be ready for that. <sighs> fuck you, fuck you, fuck you. Time for it to move the camera again, like a bastard. You're in for the 17 months.
lose this patient, no matter what. Ooh. Fucking camera. comes the fun part. What? This? Uh, what the hell? Did it just reinforce the itself? from the colony is adhering to the detached blood vessel. Uh, this isn't good. We need to hurry and detach the blood vessel. Phase three. It is, we have to extract it. Hey, wait a sec. We're dealing with an unknown virus. We can't just charge into this thing. What can we do then? There's no time for tests. Hey, give me some credit, huh? I am an expert diagnostician, you know. I'll figure out what it is while you deal with removing it. Understood. I believe in you, friend. <laughs> All right, beginning the extraction. I need to detach the blood vessels first. Here we go. All right. It did it again. I'll keep cutting it away as many times as it. What? Is it? Did I? Did I hit something? What happened? Is it not about speed? Did I hit something?
It might be random. It's cycle based. I don't think it's timed. It might be random or scripted. Well, I can't go that fast. Oh, you're good. Sized area. Yes. Get me eight screws to use for the rods. It's a standard procedure. Tighten the screws until they meet the. Oh, I hate these. Oh my god. Okay. Excited though. Right. Damn. Oh, We've got another patient incoming. This is gonna be a pain. Crying about it won't help anybody. Let's make sure we're ready. You're so damn serious all the time. Looks like we don't have a choice. complete 
All right. Bring in the next patient. Dr. Cunningham, this patient's convulsing. Oh, damn it. It just never ends. Just go. Leave this place to me. All right. I'll see you later. Bring some ribavirin, just in case we need it for next time. Miss Kimishima, Maria, I believe in you. Come on. Hello. Oh, okay. Well, detective time. Okay. Very last forensics. Wow. Come on, come on! How much farther? I don't know. I've never flown a chopper to Mexico. We're already in Mexican airspace. Now to find Rosalia. And how do we do that? We don't have a clue where she is. We have to think. How about showing people her picture? Are you kidding me? Do you know how many villages there are? Fine, Agent. Do you happen to have a better plan? Hey, what's that? Something flying. Are those... butterflies? Any of them speak Spanish. Wow. I think everyone's just gonna it's speak like English a in this game. Golden river flowing through the sky. Mm. Danaeus Plexippus. Danaeus? What's that? Monarch butterflies. This must be their migration route. They can be seen every year in this season. Beautiful. Monarchs. Monarchs only stay in America until the end of the summer. At the end of the summer, the monarch butterfly, they head south to find Asclepius to feed the larvae. Look at the picture. Monarch butterflies. Yes, she's in Mexico. The butterflies. Hey, hey, buddy, follow those butterflies. What's with you? We can't just jump around at random. It's not random. There was a monarch in Rosalia's photo. It's the same time of year, too. We can follow them. <sighs> Worth a shot. Right. Agent, follow the trail of butterflies. Yeah. Hello. Over there. Someone's over there. Fucking bizarre. Rose. So that's her. Yeah. She's turned into out of the seer. Damn. What? You've grown so big. 
I didn't recognize you. <sighs> what can we do? We can't get a blood sample from her. Agent Holden, please take Maria and search the facility. What are you going to do? I'll examine her. I might be able to learn something. Uh, hold on! We... We can't get a serum, can we? It's impossible like this. Then... Then what? Are you going to wait for the world to end? <sighs> Move. You're in my way. I have my own way. To hear her voice. Just like you. <sighs> I'll... I'll leave Rose in your hands. Yes. You're Rosalia. I've been looking for you for a while. I wonder, when did people begin to mourn each other's deaths? It's funny. Everyone has to die someday. It's for you. Yeah, pretty much since like the beginning of Homo Sapiens, even before then. I heard your final words. I'll make sure to pass them on with the time I have. <laughs> Fucking Silent Hill? Uh, what the testing. fuck? <laughs> testing. Dr. Kimishima, can you hear me? Yes, loud and clear. It looks like I can examine her normally. Uh, you mentioned that in the email. What are you looking for? If our information is correct, Rosalia was with Albert Saad. But we find Rosalia's corpse here. Isn't that odd? What's so strange about that? If Gabe brought Albert's corpse back from Usama, then he would have died in Bakko, over 3,000 kilometers away. What happened to these two must be brought to light. But will that make our situation any better? Who knows? Rosalia's corpse has become adipocere. We can't get a serum. <sighs> what a mess. This is it then? No. These two must be related to the infection source. Filling in the gaps in the timeline will reveal the truth. That's what I believe. <sighs> All right. I'll follow you to the very end. Thank you. I'm grateful for that. Uh, 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 sorry. Uh, Dr. Kimishima, can you repeat that? Uh, the uh, transmission cut out there for a moment. <laughs> Adiposia. It occurs when bacteria do not multiply. It's beautiful. As if she was still alive and with us. What's death, anyway? What does it signify? We cry when we are born. What about when we die? Die. Y you die. Let's begin. Show me the you light die. that you were robbed of. Holy fucking shit, this is boring. I guarantee you, when it's actual surgery shit, it's pretty good, Jay. I guarantee you. When you're trying to juggle like eight different patients all at the same time, it is intense shit. Helicopter. Like, bro, I could play Alien Isolation Nightmare and be good, but when I'm trying to like save eight pa patients back to back, I'm fucked up. You got shot? Wow! I fucking shot her. on the bottom of her left foot. There's dirt in the area she was bleeding from. This means that... 
What? Dirt was found around the bleeding cut of the sole of her foot. This shows that. Dirt was found around the bleeding cut of the sole of her foot. after she was injured. It must have been very difficult for her to walk at all with this wound. Jesus. This is an indication of having been shot with a gun. The bullet has completely <laughs> passed through the body. The entrance GSW is where the bullet enters the body. Conversely, the exit GSW is where the bullet exits the body. Normally, the exit wound is larger than the entrance wound. Keeping that in mind, which one is this wound? If it's hard to tell, I could always just compare it to the wound on the opposite side. Bro, I didn't see. Whee! They shot her in the fucking back. Wow. Normally the <laughs> This is the exit wound. Particles around the wound as well. Judging by the general condition of the body, this wound is gun, gun, gun. Why is her back purple like that? It's all the blood going down to the bottom of the body. Yes, this is a gunshot wound. But what could these black particles be? Still, someone shot at her hand. Why would that happen? She was covering or no. Huh. They shot her, she fell down, she tried she tried to stop herself from getting shot. And then it killed her. This it's a bullet wound. Does that mean Rosalia was shot? It looks as if the bullet passed all the way through her body. The entrance GSW convert norm keeping if it's hot. Whoa! Damn! Normal, so. Hmm. Hypostasis is present in the corpse's back. If I send this in for analysis, we might figure out the position she was in when she died. On her, on her back? She was, on her back? She was, I think, well, it'll tell me if there's nothing else to grab. Do I have to point out every single one of the holes and like say this is exit entrance? I actually can't tell with the hand. I think that's the exit wound. It seems the entrance and the egg the entrance put that That's right. This is the yeah. entrance. Yeah, what's up? I'm playing trauma team about being a doctor 80% of the time and then looking at bodies 20% of the time. I feel like the way the health person that is that ratio is What? I don't know how you called my chat out. We're, we're, I just called you out for being super important, that's it. This is a body. This is the body of a girl who was shot in Mexico. Yeah, yeah, maybe. I guess I need a little bit more context. 
yeah, you just kind of felt like, you know, being spicy and giving me a really hot take, but the problem is that I'm in person and I can immediately retort with information. I know like when you're on the internet and like when you're talking to a screen, you can just say things and then like you, you can't like be debated because there's a chat delay. But when I'm looking at you and you say something, I can actually give you an immediate response. That's not, that's not what it was. It's Started with. I told you what the game was and you decided to make it a, a horny thing off well, the bat. You, you made it a horny thing by saying when? you just stare at bodies. Like a doctor does that. Oh, no. yeah. an stay You're right, the, the verbiage is where I tripped up. It is. It yeah. Is. There's a difference. There's a difference. Because when I was talking about doctors the English and language I language is important, is what I'm telling you. The way you phrase You would say that. As an ignorant American. <laughs> Thanks. Okay, got it. Fourth of July. I'm gonna eat food and I'm gonna listen to loud explosions go. Let me do that. How's that sound? When did you make the thumbnail? Before the stream started. I built my own uh, AI model of HAL based on the uh, images that I had, and I can now generate uh, AI HAL images because of renders that I made, and I might sneeze. I won't sneeze. Judging by the accumulation of dust, it doesn't look like- Is there more of that image or is, or is that the whole thing? Like what? You, like of his shoes, of the floor, of behind the camera. What? Going to be a Halcock? Oh yeah, there's tons of Halcock. Like there's yeah yeah of course. This might not necessarily relate to this case, but it. I can make Hal smut of any variety now, uh, if that's what you're asking. Is this a bullet case? Not a standard piece of lab equipment. If I have this analyzed, I might learn some more details about it. These stains. It's blood. There's a trail of it, too. These weren't cleaned up. Could this mean these blood stains were from when the incident occurred? Is this blood Rosalia's? Or who else? Who else? Who else? And the portrait right side of the thumbnail. It's just one of the AI generations, man. Is this a voice recorder? I wonder if there's anything recorded on it. It seems to be broken. Jay's gone. He's already bored. It's a bullet case. There's a lot you can learn from a bullet case. Hmm. Trauma team. Thank you, Rufus. Does JFJ get bored easily, like a cat or something? Not if you have a laser pointer. Oh wait. Never mind. Maybe spray around. 
I guess. I just don't know where to spray. It stops here. That's something to note. Okay, well, I don't know. I have no fucking idea. Uh, Prince, maybe? I tried looking for Prince. I don't know where to fucking get him. Top right. Let me look. Yeah, it's not working. Glass below door. The glass in the door is shattered. Hmm? This is a blood stain. Could this be related to the case? I'd buy a Hal keychain. That's nice. We might get Hal gamer subs in the future. That might be a thing. If that happens, we gotta decide if it's gonna be male or female Hal. I should get this analyzed at once. <clears throat> really? Yeah, really. Did us? Yeah, did us. What flavor would you be thinking of? I would want mint chocolate chip, but it'll taste like ass because it'll be room temperature, so you'll have to put it in the fridge before you have it. Call the flavor Hal's oil change. Hmm. Want a raspberry? No. Holy shit. What? Little guy, can you analyze these black particles? Okay. This is gunshot residue. Gunshot residue? When a gun is fired, it launches more than the bullet. Particles of gunpowder are blasted out of the barrel by the force of the explosion as well. When those particles land on the target being shot at, it is known as gunshot residue. I see. So, since it was on Rosalia, that means... Indeed. It would indicate that she was shot from very close range. The entrance and exit wounds tell us what happens when someone has been shot. In this case, the victim was shot in the... Chest! Front! Yes. It then passed through her body and out. This proves that she had been shot from the... Back of the thought, if that's the case. Wow. Yes. The shooter. In any case, the wound in the thigh isn't the. Could this mean that? I think contacting little guy and at. Hey, little guy. I yes, ma'am. The bullet entered through the palm. It seems she was raising her. Why would she put? <laughs> <laughs> hmm. A defensive wound is damage taken while trying to protect oneself from harm. She likely put her hands up as an instinctive reaction to having a gun pointed at her. Little guy? Understood. That's right. The bullet entered. I don't think there was. I see. The question now is who pulled the trigger? Moody, I don't know what the fuck that means.
little guy. Yes, of course. All right. Okay. Well, the hypostasis matches it's the Splatoon position that Zarya's body was in when she was discovered. Whoa! Hmm. Hypostasis occurred. The blood settles within the corpse. Thus, Rosalia's corpse was... Yes. If the corpse had been moved... Best ice cream I've ever had? Match the position oh my god. Um, cold stone mint chocolate chip with Reese's brownies and then you put in coffee ground into it so that's like crunchy but with like Reese's and brownies and it's mint and you eat it and you go <laughs> that place truly is where Rosalia drew her last breath oh um Dr. Kimishima I have a question hopefully it's something I have an answer for what is it well the blue flowers are only growing in that one particular area of the field is that correct yeah. coffee grounds yeah you get a bit of coffee grounds and you sprinkle it in. Like crack. Yes, that's right. I mean, till coffee grounds. Dude, the thing is already overtly sweet. Is a little bit of bitter going to be like, no. No, why is it not sprinkles? Is that you? Rosalia was found in the center of this area of blue flowers. Well, isn't that too much to be coincidence? I see. No. She wasn't moved. She's dead. She did not commit suicide. So I guess we're playing to run her. What? Concentrate. We just established that she wasn't moved. And how could she have committed suicide if she has a defense wound? What? But we just said the body wasn't moved. We just said that. We just said that like a moment ago. Yes. Doesn't that make more sense? Hmm. You may have a point. Oh, okay. Well, thanks for telling me that. begins Thank to you. appear roughly 30 minutes after death. <sighs> okay. I learned something new. It's possible that her corpse was moved here immediately after she died to create the situation. If that's the case, why would her killer do such a thing to her? Uh, we're just grasping at straws here. We'll need real evidence and facts in order to solve these mysteries. Seems like it would totally match up. Whatever. Hey, little guy. Okay. Well? First of all, it bullets that side. Huh. So it's not something rare that. Unfortunately. But why was a bullet casing on the floor? That question might. I think she tried to shoot at her assailant. <laughs> okay. I found this bull. How does it look? Uh, it's a nine millimeter. Right okay, I get it. Pretty much, yes. Uh yes, please. Oh, Dr. Kimishi. Hmm? Well, the bullet cases that you. They both have a characteristic of brain. A char yes, likely formed when the empty casing is ejected from the chip. It was ejected. Are you saying the gun was an automatic? Well, the evidence suggests the use of a semi automatic pistol, not a revolver. Hmm. So, a casing is ejected after every round fired? Yes, that would be the case. <clears throat> that would mean that the places where we found those shell casings... Yes. It means that the gun was fired near those places. Great. Great. Bullet. Bullet. Hey, little guy. Oh, 
I know. Yikes. This can't be fixed. Hmm. Hey, wait a second. I might be. That would be great. Okay. Can you connect the recorder? All right. There. You don't have to. Do I'm going to. You can do that. Really? It's not that. Zip it. I'm getting mad. What was that? Uh, no. And? Huh. Wait. This file might still be intact. Hmm. All right. Right away. I'll name the file record. Good. I'll try listening to it. Hmm. I can't. If the files can be re- All right. I'll be looking forward to hearing some good news from you. <laughs> okay. Recording started August 7th. Two days ago, I verified the sample collected from the biopsy. I have succeeded in extracting the virus and will begin cultivating it as a sample. Compared to the Mononega viralis, there are 24 similarities found and... Dad, hey, Dad! Sheesh! Rose, give that back. No, it's time for dinner. Oh, is it? <laughs> I didn't even notice. I'm sorry. Sheesh, you never hear me when you're working. No more work for you until we're done eating. <laughs> well, you got me. I accept my defeat. All right, let's go to the dining room. What's for dinner today? Yeah, dinner, dinner. <laughs> hey, don't run. You'll trip and hurt yourself. Okay. Um. Um. Hey, little guy. Hmm. Making assumptions. Got it. I'll have to. Then I'll have to use. Will it take time? Yes, but I'll try to hurry it along. All right. Con. Can't believe she just said that. I don't know. Stuff. Things, things, stuff, things. Broken glass and foot. I could have swore that I did. Where is it? Oh, there it is. <laughs> okay, no. Um. Um. Great. One of those. The analysis on that blood stain. You mean the blood stain that was on the floor? What were the results? Actually, about that. Huh. That. What? There's no mistake. I compared it with the DNA. Then does that mean Albert? I don't know about that. Was he also shot? Doctor Kimishima. We don't know if that's the case yet. This blood stain. Whoa. Wait, does that was that her saying I don't need to be here? Let me see. Huh? I didn't see it among all these flowers. This may be an important clue. House. I don't know what the fuck I'm looking for. Spray in front of the door.
I don't care to find it on my own. Can someone just like tell me what to look at? Cause I, I don't, I don't, I don't fucking care. I don't give a shit. What am I looking for? Try giving the guy a new clue. Thanks. Uh, Dr. Kimishima, the uh, good. It's for the glass. Huh? Uh, right. We can determine the direction the glass shattered it. Stress. It refers to the marks left on the inner edge. The direction of impact can be found by. Is that? Well, the glass wasn't shattered from the inside. So nobody. That appears to be the case. We weren't able to find it. I see. Great. <laughs> Hey, little guy. It's a real bad. Well, just this one has similar markings on it. One bullet was shot outside. Why was the gun used here? That seems. Use ALS near for the door. Near the base of the chair on the right. Okay. I have never been interested in the detective shit. Like, the story, sure, but the detective stuff itself, I don't care. I'd rather have another Hank mission or something, man. Wow. Oh, no, apparently got all information. Thank you, Swamp, for the 30 months. Thank you very much. Nice thumbnail. Yeah, I just generated it. Today. Are Hank missions bad? No, they're great. That's why I'm saying I'd rather do them. If a bullet was fired near where the question first, we should consider the number of times the gun. That's right. A tote, but there isn't a single bullet or bullet hole in this room. Other than the cases, the only other indication of the gun being fired indoors is. Indeed, the glass at the entrance was shattered from the inside out. There is a possibility that a bullet fired from indoors broke the glass. If so, then the person who fired the gun would have had to be... I mean, I've... I've, I've uh, on the ceiling. Desk. That's right. If the glass had been shattered, there would have been gunshot residue. Thus, the bullet that broke the glass was fired from further. Okay. A shot from indoors fired towards the outside is what happened. Reanalyze blood? Of course. Desk bullet window. It's already combined, I think. Yeah, I don't know what the fuck else. I, I don't know. I'm just gonna be, yep. Here we go, we're doing this again. Gun entrance. Gun entrance? Oh, this one. I'm getting bored. Cut window.
Outside bullet casing with fatal gunshot wound. I tried that. Because I don't like reading. Fine, I'll read every single one. Fine. Okay, Swamp. Flowers didn't work. Well, I'll do it again. See, Let's try outside bullet with hand wounds. Oh, God. that this was caused by the same thing that no shit great Yeah, I don't care anymore. Uh, I'm wasting time looking at a bunch of PNGs. Put picture on other picture. I am, I am officially asking for backseating. I do not want to be here anymore. I don't care. Show new bullet casing you found in the flower field. Like that. Use it with murderous intent. I don't have it. Yeah, I saw the gun residue. Yep. Use ALS near foot of the door and use ALS near base of the chair and right. Anyways, Ghost Fund can't give you anything. It's nothing, dude. Check recording again? Fine. Even though listening to testimony doesn't do anything, fine, sure.
There's blood stain on the clothes. No shit. I should be able to find something. Check the chest. Could this blood have come from the chest wound? Christ. Yes. If it was hemorrhaging from the chest, if it spattered around this much. Annoying. Stupid. This hammer. That's right. The killer turned his gun. That bullet tore through the hand. It then continued. <sighs> the fine blood stain. The events of Rosali. First, the cause of death. Right. The bullet that went through her chest. Now, what direction did that? Oh, we won't. Fuck. Indeed. Rosalia was alive just before the evidence. I mean, yeah, the gunshot wound and the cut on the bottom of the foot were not the failed shot, so. Either or. Defensive wound? I don't think it's that, but sure. Hey, right, sure. Yes. Like any one of them the would have been applicable except for the hypostasis. Trying to protect herself from the gunshot. Her right hand also had that aid. Indeed, the gunshot residue from the shop. Gunshot residue. Yes, gunshot residue. Gunshot. Gun. We can tell that Rosalia had been shot in the chest from a short distance away. Uh, what would drive someone to be so determined to kill Rosalia? Indeed, and this is the the cause of death was a thus. Yeah, Andy, if you um, oh, you're just telling me what to do. Yeah, yeah, okay, you already know. That's right. But... Ah, Dr. Kimishima. The huh, you, did you figure? Yes. But it seems that the... Rosa yes, the... Rosalia left a blood... This glass shard, it came from the glass... That piece of... Her corpse's foot had a... This mo... Yes, from the amount of hemorrhaging, she must... The, the what broke the glass? Gun. Gun, gun broke glass. Yes, when the glass and the door shattered.
That's right. This proves that she left the room. Hmm. Rosalia's foot was cut right before she died. Given the fact that there aren't any more blood stains, Rosalia headed outside immediately after cutting her foot on the glass. In other words, Yes. She most likely avoided the, the gun was obvious. Rosalia? Why, why why is this a question? Is this a trick question? Yeah. Indeed. The shooter had been aiming at Rosalia all along. That's why she ran. In doing so, she stepped on the broke. That is what happened at the entrance to this room. Two shots were fired from inside this room. If neither of them was from someone shooting further into the room, and someone in... Little guy. Ah, uh, Dr. Kimishima. The lock? Oh, you mean the one that goes to the key fa Yes. It was a safety deposit. Good. A 9 millimeter handgun. Albert Sartre's fingerprints. Could it be that... Hmm. Let's confirm something before that. Yes, the magazine holds seven rounds, and it's possible to keep... When the gun was found, there were five rounds in it. Five shots. So the maximum number of bullets that could be missing from it is... <sighs> um... It keeps seven bullets magazine. One in the chamber. Five bullets are found with a gun. How many could be missing? Um... Um, oh no! Indeed. Right. That's the same number of cases. Uh, Dr. Q. Yes, but... Well, luckily the gun, if you can find one of the bullets from... We can use the rifling to deter... Uh, you expect me to find something that can fly over 250 meters a second? Well, yes, I know it might be a long shot, but... Looks like I don't have a choice. Gun. Please do. I'll try to come up with a different plan from here. Ah, Dr. Kimishima, we've received the result. Good. Is it about the diff- Are you some kind of- You'll pay for that slip. Hmm. Fine, but I'll remember that. Oh, yes. Uh, re regarding the- Looking at them, it appears that both wounds were made by the same caliber. Huh. But the wound- Yes, it's possible for wounds- How can that happen? The reason I can- Whoa. I see. The bullets were shot from different Way to go, Dr. Kimishima. Sucking up to me won't spare you from my wrath. Oh. Keep telling me about the report. Right. Uh, comparing the wounds in the chest to the shot that struck her thumb. If the chest wound, the other shot would have been fired. It seems that there's a big difference in the way she received both of them. Okay. She was a no her foot had been in and What? That was careless. When Rosalia was shot through the leg, she was standing in the field, you think? She ran out there first. Hey. That's right. Rosalia collapsed when there was only one place in this lab a shooter could have been stand. That is. Inside a helicopter. Yes. The bullet that hit Rosalia's. Th It'll be different. that ended looking around randomly the number of bullets that were three right one shot in the flower field 
What if that's a total of, of these three? Which one would field? That's right. The bullet shot, if it was before them, she couldn't have stepped on the glass. Then, what condition? Indeed. Wait, Rosalia was lying on the ground when she was shot. She couldn't have been standing with... So the shooter must have been standing above her. That's right. The bullet that went through her chest must be... in good condition. Whoop. Oh, was she? Oh, fuck no. Hey, little guy. You managed to find... You don't? Oh. No, 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 no. Sheesh. Did you say... No, I'll... Did you check the... Ro it's a per <sighs> Yes, there's no doubt at all that that bullet was... Bullet. What in the world? Ah, yes. Dr. Sartre, it's rifling what this sh Yes. Rosalia and Albert. What happened? Okay. Not today. Ranger oh, Echo. Sorry. Uh, Leave me five dollars. What is it? We were able to reconstruct one of the sound files. Good. Can you tell when the... Well, it seems to have been recorded after the one, but... What's wrong? It's like Dr. Jekyll. Anyway, please try listening to the new recording. I've sent it over. All right. That's the BFG 9000. Yeah, I know Ranger Echo, but thank you for the ten dollars. Thank you very much. Bomb it. That's right. Oh. Yes, that appears to be the case. Well, how this disease causes severe attacks. Disappointing. If that's the case, then yes. Just like there's a possibility that the disease undermined. Him. Yeah. Well, in any case. Hmm. Not yet. Do you mean the cause of the? Yes. Albert Rosalia, the host of the vibe. So why would and how we don't have any answers for these important questions? Sheesh. Looks like it's all over then. No. <sighs> I thought you'd say that. Huh? Oh come on. Did you even I have something to live? Hmm. Anyway, I've transferred the restore the file name. Alright. Yes, I've listened to it, and it seems the recorder doesn't have any. Alright. Hmm. Rosalia was found dead. I think I might find Okay. Okay. Sartre's, this key that Rosalia had that allowed Yes, it was a glycoprotein called immunoglobulin. The Rosalia virus, the professor tried to extract <sighs> that was a Pandora's box. Rosalia's blood was
Little guy. Oh, that's rare coming. I need to get to the boss. Huh? Didn't we what we know now may throw a new light. All right. Yes. Rosal. That's right. We had a number. We thought that the killer. Another possibility was that Rosal. Yes. Does. Indeed. One of. Huh? Mm hmm. What? Of these reasons why Rosalia was lying in, in the blue flowers. The one I ruled out is... Uh... Yes, it's impossible. The reason for that is... Right. Hey, wait. What's that? Uh, never mind. It's, uh, it's... She could have been killed somewhere else, then dragged here and shot in the... Hmm. That's not possible. The proof? <sighs> Rosalia held up this pattern of wounds could... You're right. <sighs> what do you keep muttering? Uh, if that's the case, then that means that Rosalia ran to the blue flowers. I still don't have a... It might be a good idea to... Ex I can't believe such a vibrant color exists in nature. I should send a picture. There could be a reason. <laughs> Little guy. Huh? I want to know why. There's no guarantee that it will help. Hmm. Yeah, yeah. What's the matter? Oh. What are you talking about? I want you to tell me about... That's what I'm saying. What are you saying? Asclepius doesn't have blue flower. Yes, there are, but from the shape and the, this flower... What in the world? Let's try sort of... The blue flowers in the center of the field are Asclepius, just like the flowers surrounding them. Then why are the blue... F the reason... That's right. Those flowers must have become discolored for a probable. Wow. Indeed. Rosalia would have lost all that blood, then mm. this miraculous blood, containing both the divine and the demonic. The flowers around her body absorbed Rosalia that wow. in turn. <sighs> I don't want to believe it. Yes. It's no coincidence that they were normal when she died. The Asclepius flowers most likely would cause. Pretty did this. Wow. That's right. The demon within Rosalia's vein finding another viable. I can't believe it. It may be unbelievable, but it is. <gasps> yes. Remember, adipocere normally occurs when the bacteria that this normally occurs when the corpse is stored in it, but the reason her body became adipocere was not it was because the virus within her continued to protect her body. But even if the blue Asclepius are harboring the Rosalia virus, how does that connect to the pandemic going on right now in America? It's impossible. You're right. The Rosalia virus is only even if this entire field was filled with flowers holding it wouldn't be able to cause the outbreak. Then there was a vector. A fe yes. Some method of transmission. This is how the virus spread to cause the infection. Uh -huh. Can't you tell? Butterfly! Butterfly! That's right. The monarchs are the... This is how... Another one? Yes, this file, it still exists. I see. When is that? From looking at the date. All right. St yeah, well, I felt this was... Okay. Please do. I'm Rosalia. I live here with my daddy. My daddy. 
is really nice and says a lot of nice things. Daddy's a great doctor. He says he's going to save everyone from diseases. He says I've got a poison and a cure in my body, and that the poison's really scary, but the cure is really amazing. That's why he's researching how to get that medicine out of me. If that medicine is made, I wonder if it'll heal everyone. And then I can make lots of friends and play with them. <sighs> Daddy's really bothered right now because the research is difficult. But I think I'll be okay if I can stay here like this. I can't see my brother or my big sis, but Daddy's always here for me. He's always laughing. It's really funny. I think Daddy will be happy if he can get the medicine out of me. The exams hurt. But if Daddy's happy, I'll be okay. So I hope that Daddy's research comes true soon. And then everyone can be healed. <sighs> Sad. A father who wanted to end all disease. And a daughter who wanted nothing but his success. Why does she keep saying it like that? Because you're terminally online and you have an illness. This is far too sad a conclusion to their stories. And yet, now I can see the truth behind everything that happened here. What? <laughs> Hello. This. I see. I understand now. Let's put together the truth of what happened here. We came here to find an antiserum in Rosalia's blood. But what we found was that Rosalia had already been killed. I have in my hands the card stating what killed her. Gone. Gone. Does the gun. The one who murdered Rosalia, the girl acting as a house fire was. Gun. Yes. The bullet's rifling matches that of Albert's gun. There's no doubt that Albert Sart was her killer. Three shots were fired. This card shows how it began. Desk. Nope. Correct. Albert pulled the gun from his desk and fired. He was aiming at his loving daughter who stood at the door. However, he missed and the bullet went through the glass. Whether this is due to hesitation or his condition is unknown. Rosalia fled the room trying to escape. The blood on the glass shard is from her stepping on it. She ran in desperation, but this prevented her escape. Glass. Oh, leg shot. That's right. Albert stood in the doorway and shot her. The bullet pierced Rosalia's leg and she collapsed. Albert caught up with the frightened girl as she lay there. And then... Yes. He ended her life. But Albert didn't kill Rosalia because he wanted to. He truly loved Rosalia as he would his own daughter. But he had no choice but to kill her. This card shows the reason why. Um. Buzz. Vomit because he's crazy. He's crazy. Albert had been infected with the Rosalia virus. However, this virus does more than infect the body. It eats away at the heart and soul, as in my other cases. Because Albert knew of the virus's threat all too well, in order to exterminate it, he killed his own child. 
and yet, ironically, he may have caused the exact opposite. The blood spilling from the gunshot wound in her chest provided the Rosalia virus with a new host. Butterfly. This is the true cause of the spreading infection. Butterfly. <laughs> oh, the flower. Concentrate. Yes. Flower Blue and then butterfly. Bloom flowers around her body. Drew in Rosalia's blood and became a new host for death. And so, the mass infection began. A certain organism served as a vector for the virus. Butterflies. Monarch larvae store toxins of the plants that they ingest. The monarchs carrying the Rosalia virus migrated north. And as they went, they showered death in golden scales. This is the truth behind how the virus spread. Rosalia never. Neither did Albert. No one intended for it to end this way. The virus preserves one the uh, bodies inside of... And the other his success. It keeps it alive, Richard. But that was the beginning. The evil sealed in Rosalia gained wings and flew. That's what Rosalia's last word meant. In the, in, in, in the beginning. This is the whole truth, illuminated by the light of life. You must have suffered, too. Let's end this. Okay. Naomi, come quick! We got the equipment working! All right, I'll be right... Oh, oh. Hey, Naomi? What's wrong? It's nothing. Let's go. It's not nothing. Let me take a... <gasps> you... As I said before, we don't have much time. We still have a job to do, and we must accomplish it. Hey, wait! Hey! Okay. How's it coming, Agent? Did you find anything? We've got the power back on, as you can see. The rest's a pile of records, chemicals, and equipment. You? It's all been solved. Albert Sartre killed Rosalia. How sad. His effort to save the world is close to killing it. Yes. He must have realized the virus couldn't be used. That is what caused this tragedy to strike. So, did you find a countermeasure to the virus? Yes. The virus's vector is the monarchs. The scales they lose during migration are spreading it. Don't tell me. The quarantine failed because... The monarch migration pattern extends from Mexico to Lake Erie. Even if the virus isn't airborne, it will still spread. Damn it! What should we do then? Naomi, I gathered as much as I could. Flowers? What are you planning on doing? I'll use antibody stabilizers to extract an antiserum. You can do that? Yes. Thankfully, this facility has the necessary equipment. I'll make the serum contain tripeptides in N-terminal order. Uh, all right. Just tell me what to do to help you. 
Of course. Let's get this over with as fast as we can. Great. Look very interested. I want to play a game. I don't care. I don't care. Fuck. <laughs> I don't care. We don't have enough spare interferon. The hemorrhaging won't stop. I need more gauze. Hurry up with the AED. We need to keep this patient alive. All right, please transfer one patient out. Dr. Tachibana, we're ready to begin the operation. Understood. I'll immediately... Uh, I'm sorry, I... Just a little while longer. Huh? They'll be back any minute now. I'm sure of it. Okay. Yes. Yes. Now let's do this. Yes. What? The infection is concentrated in both lungs? It's impossible to tell for certain. Yeah. To win 99 battles but lose the 100 is not the way of honor. My father, I will prove to you the strength of my resolve. Beginning the endoscopic surgery, Tachibana style. Great. Intestine help. Let's -a go. Beginning the operation. Let's save her, no matter what. Thankfully, we'll be able to treat at the bronchial level using your endoscope. Move through both lungs and find the areas that have been pathologically changed. Now listen carefully. The colonies within the organ walls are not fully active yet. Spraying an antiviral drug on the colony before treating it will keep it from bursting. We must finish excising the focus while the antiviral drug is still in effect. Understood. We'll need to treat them the moment we find them. Virus colony found. Begin working on the extraction. The colony has become dormant. I'm going to begin extraction. All right. Inject the medicine to begin protuberation. God damn it. Now ready to begin the excision. Using the scalpel to begin detachment. Careful and precise. I must finish the detachment of the antiviral drug remains in fact. This isn't good. The colony burst. Treat the affected areas that have formed quickly. Dude, I think I want to take a break from total fucking hospital hell after this game, dude. The discolored area has been reduced. Prepare for another wave of affected areas. The discolored area has shrunk even more. If we keep at it, it'll disappear completely. Nice John Neo. I don't care. I just want to be over with this shit. <sighs> funny if she died. You're really funny. Take morphine. Get addicted. Epic style. around the colony have all been treated. Let's move on. What the? We've located an affected area. Getting treatment. The hemorrhaging's been stopped. Move on to the next treatment. I want you to have Neo get XS rank? No. I don't fucking care. I do not give a fuck. $10,000. Dollars. 
Fuck off. Treating here as well. The ulcer has been treated. Continue with the procedure. We've located an affected area. Continue the blood pool has been treated. Continue with the procedure. Am I going somewhere with this? Nope. Hard to tell. Oh, no, okay. Yeah. Affected areas here too. Begin treating them immediately. Whoops. The ulcer has been treated. Continue with the procedure. There's still more. Treating here as well. The blood pool has been treated. Continuing the procedure. Viral drug. It needs to be detached now. Inject it with medicine to cause it to protuberate. Now I'm using the scalpel to begin detachment. I need to look for the excision markers. Good. Keep at it. Don't explode it! It'd be funny. It'd be funny. Why the hell am I sweating? Tube help. Intestine help. This was on timer. Yeah, that timer was nothing though, man. Was not even sweating it. Ready for other long? No! No! Did you hear the fear in my voice? We have not found shit, smile. There's one that you missed at the very beginning that's behind you? Oh, of course. Okay, hold on. Wee. Wee. 
Where the fuck? Okay. Affected areas here too. Begin treating them immediately. The hemorrhaging's been stopped. Move on to the next treatment. There's still more. The blood pool has been treated. Continuing the procedure. We've located an affected area. Getting treatment. The ulcer has been treated. Continue with the procedure. Affected areas here too. Begin treating them immediately. The ulcer has been treated. Continue with the procedure. There's still more. Treating here as well. The hemorrhaging's been stopped. Move on to the next treatment. Can't wait to be done with these missions, man. found. Begin working on the... The more antiviral drug you spray, the longer it will remain in effect. Look at the condition of the affected area and judge how much you'll need. The affected area is protruding. Beginning detachment. Don't burst, please. I will save her. I'm going to save her. Detachment complete. Now to retrieve it. No affected areas remain. Moving on to the next area. World gut game. Yeah. <sighs> what the fuck is it? Well, it's gotta be up ahead. Yeah, it has to be that way. Alright. Yeah, there's nowhere else it can be. It's gotta be that way. Of course. Antiviral drug. It needs to be detached now. Inject it with medicine to cause it to protuberate. to the next area. Fuck. Woohoo! Yeah! Huh? 
Yeah? Where? Doctor, we can't go any further back without the endoscope falling out. Funny if it did, though. It was there? Cool. I'm gonna go look at there. That's dead end. Yeah. Oh, hey, there we are. Maybe. I don't see anything, though. Yeah, I see nothing, of course. for the five years of lunch money. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. The more antiviral drug you spray, I, look at the bitch, I know. And judge how much you'll need. Can I just pull all the way out? Doctor, we can't go any further back without the endoscope falling out. This sucks. That's the other lung. Down. Fucking where? Uh, this sucks so hard, dude. This is so fucking boring.
Yep. We've apparently already been here. Where the fuck? So bored. You know what I think happened? I think I was in an area that was unexplored, but then um someone told me to go back, and then I did, and now it's just it's just one of these one of these tubes. Smile. Fucking boring shit. This might be a quitting point for me. I do not care. I'm so bored. Need help? How could you help me right now? Tell me. Keep looking for any remaining colonists. Oh! <laughs> this sucks so hard. We've gotten careless. I didn't even think such a blight could exist. Doctor, we should change this operation to a surgical procedure. If we can extract it whole along with the surrounding tissue... No! The endoscope is the best tool for precise treatment while avoiding stimulating the focus. A surgical procedure may cause it and the other colonies to all burst together. <laughs> it may be hopeless, but we have no choice. What? Save state. Yeah, I ain't gonna do all this shit again. I don't care. I don't care. I'll scum this. I do not care. I am not doing this shit again. No. No, dude. Not fucking happening. Nope. Is 
the injection affecting the colonies nearby? It seems that they're connected within the wall of the organ. If we don't take care with how much we inject, we could cause multiple bursts. How much should we play Battle Bit instead of this? I'm so close to finishing it, Sierra. I'll just thank you for the five dollars. Also, I don't, I don't. Uh... Uh, let's do this. And then um. colony rise up but the medicine affects the area around it as well we'll have to estimate how much medicine to inject at any given time none that's too bad that's just not happening yeah that's not happening i can't revert it it's already fucked oh well Load state, maybe. Be funny. Be funny. Be funny. Be funny. I have a bad feeling about this. Be extra careful. What? Oh, okay. You do that. We're all good. We're all good. All right. The medicine's evenly distributed. Let's begin the excision. Watch this. It's been detached. I can't believe how large it is. I'm going to begin detaching the large colony. Halfway through. Can't afford to make it. Just a little more. Decision complete. Retrieving the detached focus. God, that sucked. Please switch out the snare. Watch out for hemorrhaging. Administer interferon. Watch the vitals. Please, Maria, Miss Kimishima. Please come back. This is Maria Torres. Come in. Over. Why does she get so many fucking missions? Who told Tomoe that she was the most important character? turn their heads aside make sure they don't choke on anything like their own vomit check on them from time to time to update triage tags huh this is Lucas site dropping in 10 9 8 7 that's huh To land on someone. Maria, Chief, we brought the 
serum. Start distributing it. All right. Hey, where are you? Ah! Game over. You died. Restart. Maria. Tomoe, the serum. Use this. Quickly, set it into the endoscope. All right, it's good to go. I'm starting the treatment at once. Let's end this war. Okay. Same level, let's go. The anti-serum inhibits the Rosalia virus's growth. It has no effect on areas that are already affected. Understood. I'll inject the serum after treating them. The colonies have begun Fuck to appear. Fuck my life. We won't lose. We will stop this virus. One short, I don't believe you. I'll only believe it when it's over. All right, the Indeed. Oh, Let's hurry. Whoops. The procedure will be just as I explained it before. The serum will not Bonus work on the affected lungs. areas that have already formed. Treat all the affected areas first, then inject the serum into the discolored area. I understand. We'll win this fight no matter what happens. area and use the anti serum The affected areas have been treated. Inject the anti serum The discolored area has gotten smaller. We can do this. serum before more appear. The serum is having an effect. Good. Now finish it off.
Thank fuck. The vitals are stable. We're done. Operation complete. We... We did it? We did it! It's over! We won! Whoa! Uh, hey! Maria. Yes! Yes, we won! We've won! Oh, this is so <laughs> awesome! Fucking face. Love you guys. It's all over, Professor Sarge. Whoa! He cracked a smile. I didn't know you could. What the... Make up your mind. Are you happy or angry? <laughs> Stop. Stop it. What? Nice timing. I forgot to ask what you want on your tombstone. <laughs> I can't die. You owe me, remember? Hey, easy. I never want to look after a fogey like you again. I'm glad to see that you're all right. <laughs> Surprised? Don't worry. If anything happened, I'd operate on you. That's a good sign. Uh, right. I had something to tell. Uh -huh. Jump scared. You guys are. Jump scared. Don't hide Jump scared. over here and <laughs> smile at each other. Join us. Oh, no. You're not going anywhere. Start celebrating, damn it. Maria, please. Don't push so much. Hey, keep it down, you numbskulls. This is still a hospital. Oh, <laughs> crap. Cheap's fist. Great. It's another mission. All right, sure. I'm hungry as shit. I think I'm gonna get a burrito. I'm just a little bird. I can't possibly defeat a monster. How can I ever save this poor princess? Great. Thank you, Nash. Thank you for clearing things up. Appreciate that. is the affected area. Please, look at this. That idiot. Why didn't she notice before now? She must have hidden it from everyone until this point. Where's the kid? He's preparing for the operation. Maria will be assisting. Yes, she was infected with an unusual agent in the past. Most likely, the gene propagated into her cells. 
and was activated concurrently with the viral infection. So that means it's an evolved form of the Rizali virus. What's Dr. Kimishima's condition? It doesn't look good. It's centered in the worst possible area. I is it Rosalia? I don't know, but I've asked for some special help. Special help? An old friend of mine. Don't worry, he's a great doctor. We've done all we can. All we can do now is pray for her health. To be honest, these materials can't tell me everything, but... Listen carefully, please. If the focus is as I predict... Are you ready? Yeah. Life will continue. This is the final battle. Let's begin. giant virus colony located on her heart. Pang should be doing this operation. What the hell is this? It looks like a pupa. Indeed. Here are. It's formed an outer shell from mutated biofilm. Injecting the serum like this will have no effect on it. What? Since the colony may explode... We yeah, that image got so it. large, dedicated. I gotta fix that. I don't know why it's so large. But Naomi isn't strong enough to use a heart-lung machine. Then what in the world are we supposed to do? We're gonna cut it out. What? We'll start incising at the left atrium to remove the shell. We'll then stop her heart and finish up before it's too late. You're asking for one hell of a miracle. That's right. <clears throat> Going to be working a miracle. You make it sound so easy. Fine. Let's make this happen. Uh, Maria. Huh? Thank you. It's because of you, I... Huh? I couldn't hear you. What'd you say? Now, let's begin the operation. Okay. Let's begin the operation. Oh, it's on time. Okay, great. I've made the initial incision. Opening her up. Thank you, my strange life. Two dollars. Thank you, twelve oh nine. Thanks. Thank you. Hey, don't tell me. Is this a heart? Central areas hypertrophy. Would it rip out her heart? <laughs> this is just ridiculous. There's a giant colony right in the middle of her heart. Maria, huh? get a grip on yourself. Please, I need your help. Damn it. I know. Let me confirm the procedure. And then we'll treat the left ventricle. Got it. Look, I need you too. Don't let her die. Do I even need to respond to this? Yes, We're a team. They scar on his face. Come on. Let's do it. Now this is Dr. the final battle. Dr. North Paging Dr. North. <laughs> Indeed. Beginning the procedure. Making the incision into the left atrium. Yep. I thought it... First, we destroy the outer shell with the laser to expose it. We'll deal with the main body at that point. All right. Don't forget to treat the multiplying colony as well. All right. Keep using the laser. Bomb. It's getting weaker. Just a little more. <sighs> what happened? The outer shell regenerated? Good. Destroy it all. It's no good. What the hell's going on? Let's 
eject the vasoconstrictor. Wait. Wait. Oh, I can just suck them in right away. I didn't know that. Ready to inject the vasoconstrictor. I need the syringe. The deactivator's taking effect. Beginning the excision using the scalpel. The virus just took a huge hit and we have to treat the new colony. Excision complete. Readying the tray. One more to go. Continuing treatment. Now use the vasoconstrictor. The deactivator's taking effect. Beginning the exit. Now to extract the focus. Forceps. Our oh, has been drained. Keep up the good work. Good. Destroy it all. Pieces of the shell have injured the heart. I'll have to suture it. Shall regenerate it. You're kidding! Your condition isn't stabilizing. We have to ready to inject the vasoconstrictor. I need the syringe. Let's treat these remaining wounds and move on to the next section of her heart. Let's close it up. Hand me the sutures. Just two more to go. Stay strong, Naomi. Opening the right atrium. Prepare the scalpel for incision. Let's be careful in there. Why? Why have so many colonies been created? It's evolving. Uh, evolving? It's absorbed a different virus's DNA and is constantly mutating. Now it's creating a new form to adapt to its new environment. Huh? It may be natural, but we don't have to accept it. <laughs> I will eliminate this. Let's do it. All right. Injecting the vasoconstrictor. Nice. Excise the colony. The colony has been excised. Extract the first replicated colony has been extracted. Continuing the treatment. It's getting weaker. There's still pieces of the ship. The colony piece exploded. All right, that's the first injection. Keep treating the other areas. The 
Jones has disappeared. Continuing with the treatment. and the tray. Good. Destroy it all. We need to extract the shell pieces. Oh, it's gonna be on screen forever. Let's stay on our Whoops. Jesus so fucking Christ. Can we treat them all? I believe in you. I'm sure you can do it. Thanks. Right. I know what you mean. I'll save her. No matter. All right. Let's inject the vasoconstrictor. I need the syringe. Hey, don't get twitchy. Inject it into the colony. Now they're coming up again. Colony. Watch out for the pieces in the bloodstream. One extraction is complete. Continuing with the procedure. Nope. Nope. Closing up here, then move it. 
Closing the right ventricle. Get the sutures ready. The main body's in here, right? Yes. Making an incision to expose the affected area. This, it's the main body of the Rosalia virus, but mutated. We really are going to do this, right? Right. The cardioplegic solution is ready for us. Injecting that will stop her heart. All right. Let's go over the procedure one last time. When we inject the solution, the heart will stop and we can excise the membrane. After membrane extraction, we'll inject concentrated antiserum into the main body. Got it? Yeah. There's never been a heart-stopping operation performed without a heart-lung machine. Please, we've got to finish everything before now. You guys are telling me to save on. state, but where's the fun in that? Where's the fun in that? <laughs> you gotta be fast. Timer, mow. We need stakes. It's true, we do. Besides, if I fail this, I'll just watch the ending cutscene and we'll be good. So, yeah. Extremely fast. Okay. Let's begin. I'm a doctor. Saving lives is my purpose. Scalp. Forceps. Now, injecting the serum. Ugh, we're not done yet, you monster. This will be the end. Be gone! What? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> the mutant Rosalia has disappeared. Is it over? Treatment complete. The procedure was a success. We, we really saved her. Oh, right. Oh, you're done suturing it? Sorry. Yeah. Closing the operation area. You should rest a bit. It's almost over. Let's close the curtain on this. Bandaging the sutured area. This will finally be the end. Operation complete. Let this disease pass from this world. <laughs> B. Oh, some homies now. Yes, the operation was a success. She'll wake up soon. You're amazing. Seriously, it was like watching a magic show. S for sturgeon. You're awake. How do you feel? I'm alive. Yes. The focus on your heart was removed. You're safe. I see. And the others? Same as usual. It's like this whole thing was a bad dream. Maria's fighting with the paramedics like always. Dr. Freebird's being twisted around his patient's finger. Great. I don't think there's much to say about Dr. Cunningham. And lastly, he went back to prison. But... 
It seems his circumstances have changed somewhat. Great. I see. This world may be brief, but to reject it is dishonorable. Huh? You can't give up. There's someone who still needs you. I know. Even if it is only for a little while longer. I don't know about that. What? Dr. Kimishima. The dormant genetic disease you had has completely vanished. What are you saying? I mean, I'm... You're not going to die. We believe that your cells... Their disease factor was expelled by the Rosalia virus. <gasps> that means... I'm... Dr. Kimishima, I have a message from all of us who helped you. There may be relapse. There's no way to know the future. But still, we want you to keep looking forward to living your life. Know me! Alyssa! Thank you. Thank you so much. Okay. Oh, that's it. Great. Jesus Christ. Ugh. Oh my God. Oh, oh fucking great. There's post credits. Stick around. We're gonna do a. Okay, maybe we won't do that. I was gonna fast forward, but it kind of sounds like ass. I mean, if you want, it, it just sounds like a. Yeah, Cluster Protocol is just a fucking abysmal excuse of garbage writing. Thank you for the $10 monthly on. Okay. Fast forward here. I'm sorry. Great. Thank you, Mug Man. Good job. You looks like it's all come to an end. Oh, you look beat. You want me to examine you? <laughs> yeah, well. What the fuck? Not surprised. <laughs> what you're tired. the fuck? You did well. <laughs> you keep standing there. You're gonna catch a cold, you know. Great. Wow, me, me, am. me. Wow. I'm curious. Greetings, Doctor. Hello. New reports have come in regarding the Rosalia virus infections in the Portland area, including Resurvey. 
The pandemic has been confirmed, remedied. Upon recommendation from hospital staff, you have received specialist authorization. A new difficulty level, specialist, is available for those with high degrees of medical skill. A special gameplay element, Dr. Metals, is now available. Dr. Metals is a system of medical performance assessment. Fulfill special conditions in each stage to be awarded with applicable medals. Details about the medals you have earned will be displayed on the information screen. Doctor, I have found something of interest. There are records that have been deleted from this hospital's data archives. I have recovered these files. Please confirm them using the extra icon in the lower left. My suit reaching its limits. The um, chest area is getting a little tight. Hmm. Is it possible I've put on extra weight? <laughs> nah. These pecs are rock solid, and these latissimus dorsi. One heck of a hole. I'll have to start all over. Great. Okay. No, dude. I'm sure there's like. Actually, I'm curious. Now, this part's the most important, Roni. I need your support. Understood, Doctor. First, crack an egg into a bowl. Hmm. A bowl? I... I don't... have anything like that lying around. Requisite utensils for this recipe are insufficient. Would you like to prescribe a different dish to make? No. It's all about flexibility. We just need a container. This should do. Dr. Cunningham, that is a beaker. I know. Tell me how to make scrambled eggs with a beaker. I find nothing in my database that matches that instrument. What? It's the same thing! Just adjust the container size! Understood, Doctor. Please specify your search criteria. Hey, man, I just want something to eat. Do you have any idea what it's like to be on an empty stomach? I do not, Doctor. Only humans experience hunger. Gah! You know, you really get on my nerves some days. Oh, my stomach. I'm not gonna make it. Great. Well, that was uneventful. All right. Well, that's the game for me. That's the game for me. Okay. Yeah. Okay. That was the whole game. Well, Twink, I don't give a shit. All right. Yeah. Yeah. You want to hear that one? I don't care. I don't care. Uh, I don't care about audio. Yeah. Okay. I'm going to go. You want to watch the Surgeon and Naomi Extra? You can YouTube it. You can go on YouTube. Use the video website from your computer. Okay, I'm gonna go uh, probably start editing Mario Party next stream. The large edit. Going to large edit. 
and eat like a hot dog or something. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.